please consider subscribing. Thank you for the support. Valve has just made some big announcements considering the esports scene in Counter-Strike. Amidst all of those, the most striking part to me is this point that they made right here. Any compensation for participating teams, prize pool or otherwise, will be made public and will be driven by objective criteria that can be inspected by the community. Meaning that we will be able to tell if a sticker is overinvested in or if it's not. Right now, all we have is sticker application data from CSGO Float, but with this new change, we will be able to compare the application rates to the total amount sold, thus determining how many are sitting in storage units as investments. We will then have a much clearer idea of a sticker's actual supply and demand to determine its real value as an investment. And god, I wish we had this for Paris right now. These changes will take effect in 2025, so CS2's first major won't be impacted. This makes me super excited for future major investments, but also deeply scared. As we all know, teams get 50% of profits from sticker sales, meaning that teams will be pushing Valve to make borderless stickers, making each iteration less valuable than the previous one. And as we've seen with Rio, stickers with borders just don't sell as well as the borderless ones. It really seems like the most obvious choice for Valve would be to keep making borderless major stickers so that they and the teams make more money, even if that is to the detriment of capsule investors. If you learned something new from this video, make sure you subscribe so that you don't miss out on any of my new uploads. And as always, thanks for watching, and I will see you all later.